Hello, everyone. RPG, get him, get here. Back with some more. Uh, I almost said Final Fantasy. No, uh, Super Smash Brothers Ultimate. In the previous video, we did Mewtwo, and now we're going to do another DLC character. This time, we're going to do Min Min. That's right. Min Min, Min, Min is the. This will be the first time I've ever done anything as Min Min. Um, I'm excited. I'm probably gonna fucking suck at it, but uh, you know that's part for the course. Let's fucking go. Ready? Go! God, I know there was like a way that you could change the arms, but I can't remember. Nice. Mimmin's fun. I mean, granted, this is the first time I'm playing as her, so I don't know how. Plus, I also don't know how to play as her, so. Nice. Ah, oh, look at that. That she's cute. Min Min's cute. So when it comes to arms, I did that like little. I did that like demo thing that they had before the game came out. And I was terrible at it, if you guys remember. Fuck you! God damn it! Continue. Continue. Fuck you. Suck my dick. Wow, I only went up by point two. Donkey Kong. Ready? My guess is that's supposed to be like uh the mummy dude from arms. Master mummy. Something like that. Oh, down B is switching. Oh, 
All the arms characters. Her final smash is actually kind of cool. Oh no, another point too. Rob. Ready? Go! Come on, guy, you little jump, fucking jumping bean. Mimin's fun. I would say I need to like be better, but then again, that's just overall in this game for me. I think Mimim Min was a good choice for like the first DLC character of the new pack. I think that was a good choice. Now, Graham, we are halfway through with um the DLC pack two. I have a feeling we will get another first party character, but I feel like the the last one, the last per, uh, persona, the last um character for. The last character for the DLC pack has to be a non third party uh, one. Like, uh, it can't be like an. Like, it can't be a Fire Emblem character. It can't be like a Pokemon. But if it does end up being that. Uh, I, I do for sure see it, us at some point getting a Pokemon character. Uh, my guess is that's the next one. Like, the next one has to be a, a, a first-party uh, Nintendo character. And as far as I can tell, like, it has to be, like, a Nintendo character. Uh, oh, Nintendo. Has to be a po Like, a Pokemon is my best bet of that being the next DLC character. And then, I mean, Fortnite guy will probably show up at some point. Fortnite guy will probably be the last one. You know, he'll be a fucking lukewarm one. Honestly, I'm, like... I'm someone in the same boat as some people. I'm like, I, I'm fine with, like, doesn't matter who is the next DLC characters. I'm fine with Sephiroth. Like, Sephiroth, to me, I feel like, yeah. Unless, like, if we get Sora, which... I don't... Like, 
I know Sora is technically owned by Disney, so he'd technically be a Disney representative. But more people associate him with Square Enix. I mean, granted, it's a game developed and published by Square Enix, right? It's so published and developed. I can't remember the, the technicality of it. The point is that if we do get Sora, I feel like the majority of people will, be, will complain. It's like, oh, why did Square Enix get two represents? Even though technically... Even though technically Sora is a Disney. I mean, like I said, Sephiroth, getting Sephiroth, like getting some more Final Fantasy representation is actually kind of cool in my opinion. So I'm a big, I'm a okay with that. I just feel so bad, like for the Geno people. When Gino became a me costume again. But yeah, they had to like somewhat saw that coming. I mean, there's always there was always a slight possibility of hope that we would have gotten. Like, and that's the thing, like a lot of people were like scared that, like, oh well, here we go. Sword's gonna be a me costume, so. And we didn't get that, so. We'll see. I won't mind, like. If Sora does get into Smash, that'd be cool. But I feel like we have to, like, let's not get a Sword character for a while. Granted, there's only three slots left. I, I do feel like the next the next character is going to be a per... A, God damn it. A Pokemon? If, not, if it's not a Pokemon, it's for sure going to be a first-party uh, Nintendo character. I can see that for sure. So. But uh Anyway guys that's going to do it for this part of Let's play Super Smash Bros Ultimate In the next part guys we're going to play another DLC character That's right we're going to do two DLC characters in a row And then I'm going to do two non-DLC characters in a row So thank you all so much for watching this video Guys if you liked the video please give that like button a click Comment down below what you guys liked about the video Didn't like about the video Let me know what you guys think of uh of Min Min, what, what were your guys' thoughts when she got announced? I, me personally, I was like, okay, yeah, you know, what? I, I, I was like, you, you obviously saw there was going to be a, a, uh, an arms uh, person represented in this game. So yeah. And as well as guys, hit the subscribe button so you don't miss a beat and subscribe to my main channel too. That's in the description below. As well as follow me on Twitter. Both my main Twitter, RBG Kim Kid Twitter, are in there too. Thank you all so much for watching once again, and I'll see you all next time.